Okay. Hello. Go ahead. Hello. We're about to hear him talk about how this is no longer Portland. Special. You heard it here first. I was now the only person that saw something wrong here. He has also noticed a rift in the matrix. We're about to document that. And then we're going to find our next vehicle here. Yeah. We're going to find our next vehicle here after we find out why this is no longer Portland. Exclusive. Exclusive interview. I got it. Okay. okay. All right. Well, we'll see you later. Well, the top five reasons why it's no longer Portland. Oh, no. I mean, it's just, uh, it's like, this is my comment, just real quick. It's like, I, we know what the Indians felt like. Like, the, everybody else has discovered Portland. Like, wait a minute, we were here. But now all the things that were nice about Portland that made it such a wonderful place are have followed the, play, the things that were bad about the energy from the, the people coming here. So they brought their energy with them as if they can, like, the place itself is the place. The place is here in your head, and it's a created creation. So, at, so I don't even know what this place is anymore, really, honestly. It's a different place. It's in transition. Yeah, but I mean, everything is. Nothing stays the same. Right. But I do feel like an like an American Indian, Native American Indian. You're like, what are these people even talking about? Like, they, you know, they had this concept, which were even alien to us. Like, well, how can you own anything? <laughs> you know what I mean, right? I mean, we're like, oh yeah, we own, we found. Not only did we own it, we found it. Who are you guys? <laughs> you know. So, that was it. Okay. Okay. We'll see you later, James. Well, that was great.